Hello, what's up YouTube? Ron is weird and I show and in this tutorial I'll show you guys the easiest way to fix cursor issues in Photoshop. So there are those instances whereby the cursor doesn't look exactly the way it is meant to look in Photoshop. So for example, on my quick document right here, it is white in color. So I'm just going to get a black brush and come and measure sure everything, opacity and the flow at 100 then increase on the size and I'm just going to make a point right here just like that so you can see that this cursor is showing even the boundaries that it is such like in shape so the issues are by your cursor turns to that cross like icon that tends to come as a result of turning on the caps lock key so if I told you come and turn on the caps lock key you're going to get this cross like icon so make sure that Whenever you're using any tool, depending on what you're trying to do in Photoshop, always make sure that the caps lock key is turned off. So this is the very same tool, because if at all I make a point right here, it is going to make the same point. But this is like a targeted kind of format for this very tool. So this is more of, if at all you want to be specific with making a point or an ad adjustment on a given point so you can easily use this kind of format for this tool but if at all you're using it for your daily purposes make sure that you turn off the caps lock key and you get back the tool the way it is meant to look so even if i come and i select maybe a spot healing brush tool you can see right now it is showing me the edges or the boundaries but when I turn on the caps lock key it is going to be able to show it as a cross like icon so in order to get rid of this cross like icon you can simply turn off the caps lock key and you get back the boundaries or the tool the way it is meant to look in Photoshop so even if I come and I get my lasso tool so you can see that the lasso tool is showing the icon the way it is meant to be but when I turn on the caps lock key, it is going to be able to hide the original shape of the of that lasso tool. So basically, this is an easy fix for your tools looking like cross-like icons. So if at all you have been maybe doing skin retouching and removing blemishes, and you want to get back the tool, and maybe you had accidentally clicked on the caps lock key as you're doing your editing and your tool turns out to look like this cross like icon you can come and simply make sure that you turn off the caps lock key and you get back the tool the way it is meant to be so you shouldn't be in shock or worried the next time you come across this issue when you're doing your photoshop work so basically this is it for today's tutorial Ronix from Ronix Photography thank you for watching and I'll see you in yet more tutorials on this channel. Don't forget to keep practicing and keep creating.